favorite questions. And I know it's a repeat, but I've gotten so many of these in the inbox lately. I figured, you know what? It's a good refresher, especially for this time of year. From Brett in Makokoda, one of our good weather watchers from around the region here. What is corn sweat and why does it make it feel so much hotter outside? So corn sweat is essentially what we're saying. The corn itself actually sweats. It releases water and moisture into the air. It is one of those plants that has so much water moving through it. In fact, at its peak, which we're getting into here right now as the corn begins its tassel stage, it's capable of putting more than a quarter of an inch of liquid water into the air every single day. That is what adds to the humidity and all that moisture that we feel when it gets real hot and humid around here. So we're approaching the peak now. Once it gets closer to maturity later in the fall, we'll start to see that subside. But you notice we got a ways to go here. That's going to remain fairly elevated. So let's talk about why all that moisture makes us feel warmer. When you've got a lot of it sitting into the air, our body tries to cool itself by sweating. That sweat tries to evaporate. Well, when the air around your skin is already full of water, the water on your skin has nowhere else to go. It just stays there and you feel sticky, you feel miserable. But on a day like today, where we don't have a lot of corn sweat and we don't have a lot of humidity, that moisture can more easily evaporate off your skin and leave your skin and cool you down. That's why days like today feel so much more comfortable, even if you're doing strenuous activity outside, versus a day where we've got a lot of humidity and a lot of corn sweat. You can already read more about it at WQAD.com. It's there right now. When we come back, we'll start tracking when the heat returns next.